Karen Jo Smith disappeared December 27, 2000, in the hands of her ex-husband, who has been convicted 95 years. We are still searching. We're still working on tips. We do have the most recent news is that he has no more appeals. Still in isolated segregation concerns me, and it does some of us to get the detective to get in there before he goes totally crazy. Um, her children are growing wonderful. She'd be so proud of Brandon. Of course, Stephanie now is 16. Karen would have more dye on her hair <laughs> because of Stephanie's her wild child twin. The family is healing as well, uh, but each time we hear, as most of us do, of any location of any remains or anything, it sets us in that cycle. We're back where we began. Mm, not a whole lot more to go on as far as, again, the case than what I just said. We are working still as a family in any way we can within the confines of the law. This may be the day. We hope and we pray it is. But we get back up again tomorrow and start again. And she knows it. I miss her love. I miss her, <laughs> not just her haircuts, her sparkle, her fight, anything like that. But because of her, so many of us have been brought together. She